<laughs> Dad. <laughs> Dad. <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I did nothing in my life that could gain your approval. Every ounce of my being to clean the house of ours. Of course, it was never my house. It was always your house. It's never part of an inheritance that would be given to me when you die. I have no inheritance. I have no assets. But I cleaned. I have no stocks and bonds. But I did everything I could in school to gain your attention. And still, you preferred whores over the commitment that you should have had to my mom. I cleaned and I cleaned out of my anorexia because I thought that if I kept your house clean, you would see that you had a lot with us and you would never give it up to a whore, but you did. Dad, I wanted your love. I was never a fighter. I was a cleaner. I became a busboy, Dad, because I didn't have any skills. You never taught me about your real estate. You never showed interest in me. Maybe if you gave me attention and approval, I would have been more into mathematics. But you never really wanted me to live higher than you. I filed bankruptcy in my 30s. You explained to me that I would never buy a house. So it doesn't matter. Dad, I wanted you to bail me out. I clean to this day. I'm not a dishwasher anymore. I work for the dump. And no woman wants to be with a man like me, Dad. Too rich. And you preferred whores. Over and above. You transferring your prestige to me. Dad, I just wanted your love. You never wanted to show me your body because you thought it was incestual because I loved you. It had nothing to do with me seeing your genitals, Dad. It had all to do with you putting your arm around me and letting me know that I don't have to be afraid and do things in the streets out of desperation but I came from your body and I'm part of you Dad I've cleaned up my mouth I no longer use the vile profanity I did when I was in jail and I told you how I wanted to kill you Dad, I've had nightmares of you slashing my wrists when I gave you my resume. I had nothing more on it than Taco Bell because I was a dishwasher. Dad, I clean the bottom of my nails every day after the dump because I want to be clean for you and I want to be touched by you, Dad. I never wanted sex with you. 
I wanted you to tell me I was part of the family. Dad, <laughs> why didn't you tell Mom to get an abortion? So I wouldn't have to live this? Dad, <laughs> where are you? Please help me, Dad. <laughs> help me, Dad. Learn about money. Teach me how to count change. You never did, Dad. All I became was a street cleaner before the dump. <laughs> Dad. Dad. I had nightmares of you murdering Mom. Dad. Why do you hate us, Dad? We were never dirty hours, Dad. We cleaned the house for you, Dad. We thought nothing more about food, Dad, if the house wasn't clean enough for you. And you, you went off in those homes. And when Mom didn't have any affection from you, Dad, she came to me when I was a young boy, Dad, and I was to take care of her emotionally. I was a surrogate husband, Dad. Instead, you ended up on me aside and told me that I would never be homeless, Dad. All I needed was your love and your loyalty to our family. And you think I lost everything, Dad, to homelessness? Heroin? Dad. You lost everything. You lost hope in us. <laughs> I am <laughs> from any thoughts of you, you dirty son of a... <laughs>